But where and how you get it, well, that's up to you. And that's what we're interested in. So we're going to try a bit of a study. So today we're at the Halifax Seaport Market. Um, we are going to make a comparison between the market and just a regular superstore. So I'm at the Atlantic Superstore as one of many groceries in Halifax. So we're going to take around $60 and we're going to spend that money on groceries. What I'm going to do is try to uh, find similar or basically identical items at the Superstore uh, and we're going to compare them. I actually love the taste of raw kale. I know a lot of people don't really, don't really like it. Green cheese, 550 for this nice size brick right here. So, to the basket, let's move on. I'm a big fan of these, these chocolate bars. You can get many different flavors, an assorted variety, let's say. Uh, so, I'm going to get uh, the sea salt chocolate bar and why not the lime zest? After buying the groceries, we took them home and tried comparing them by price. Here are the results. Now, this isn't a very exact financial comparison. Prices fluctuate, we bought different quantities, and we had a limited budget. We're not NASA. And we may have made a couple mistakes, such as buying different types of apples, or even different cuts of meat. Sorry. I think in general, the items from the Superstore were quite consistent in their shape and size, but it also tended to look somewhat prefabricated and suspiciously perfect. Yeah, whereas the items from the farmer's market weren't that consistent in shape or size, but to me, they had more of a homemade and natural feeling to them. So there are the results from our study. Take from it what you will. But I think that comparing the farmer's market to the supermarket is more than just comparing apples to apples. Other than the fact that you're buying groceries, the two couldn't really be any more different. The supermarket is good if you're looking to get your groceries quickly and efficiently. Everything is well organized and if you're prepared, you can get in and out with your groceries in a smooth 30 minutes. They have locations all over Halifax, so it's pretty easy to find one. You aren't necessarily going for an adventure, or to have fun even, but you go there because we all have to eat. The farmer's market, however, while it might take longer to find everything you need, is a bit more of a social experience. You can go with your friends or bring the whole family, stop by for some coffee, and maybe listen to some music. But aside from all that, the food at the market is locally grown and the products are often homemade, so you know where your groceries are coming from. So there you have it, two different ways of getting groceries around Halifax. You know, if you're, if you're in a hurry and you really gotta eat, you know, go ahead, go to the superstore. But if you're looking for a richer experience, why not check out that farmer's market sometime? We're planet back. You are what you eat.